there, welcome to my channel. My name is Doug and I'm back with another fountain pen video. Today I'm going to try to make the case that Pen BBS of Shanghai, China is the best fountain pen maker in the world. Now that's a pretty bold statement and I state it out loud because, well, it brings in more views for my channel. At least I didn't put a thumbnail on the video with me with a face like this. Seriously though, I think Pen BBS should be considered as one of, if not the best, fountain pen company in the world based on their quality, independence, innovation of design, and affordability. Certainly, you can say all of your Mont Blanc, Pelican, Waterman, Lamy, Sailor, Pilot, Faber-Castell, all of the big boys are arguably the best fountain pen companies in the world. If you're talking price, prestige, history, all of those things, you might be right. But I'm talking about pens that most anyone can afford. Pens that are not only affordable, but there's such a variety of styles, finishes, and filling systems. There is something for every eye and every hand. They are continuing to come up with new innovations and new products constantly. I don't see this kind of commitment to fresh thinking in other pen companies. So please join me as I explore what I think is the best fountain pen company in the world right now. <music> I know it's a wild claim to make that Pen BBS is the best fountain pen company in the world, but I've collected a lot of pens over the last three years, and the most I've purchased from one company have been from Pen BBS. Now, perhaps if I were Rudy Giuliani, I might have collected hundreds of Mont Blancs instead, but I'm talking about an ordinary pen enthusiast who doesn't have thousands of dollars to spend on pens per month. So, yes, my claim of the best fountain pen company in the world has a caveat for ordinary pen lovers without a million dollar budget i would have said that on my thumbnail and title but the printing would have been so small even rudy couldn't read it there are other companies that have more current models like hero moonman majon and jin hao and if you include all the pens that hero and jin hao make as oem manufacturers for other brands in the world the list runs to thousands of models there are some pen companies that have had many more finishes available on their models, like Leonardo, for example, where they are seemingly coming out with new finishes every day. But I did say affordable, and a Jonathan Brooks acrylic Leonardo is not in the realm of affordable for most fountain pen lovers. They are nice to look at, but $600 is not affordable. What about a pen company that has had more innovations, more changes, more new finishes, more new filling systems, more new interesting product ideas than anyone else, and sells them for under a hundred bucks? I can't find anyone that has the range of models, the range of filling systems, range of acrylics, and the number of new innovations that Pen BBS has had over the last three years. If anyone out there can point me to a company that does what Pen BBS does, please let me know in the comments because I haven't seen anything close. So if you will indulge me, I want to take you through some of the amazing things that Pen BBS has had to offer over the last three years. And we'll start with filling systems because, again, I don't know any other company that has come out with everything that Pen BBS has. So, category one, cartridge cartridge converter, and eyedropper pens. I put these three filling systems together because the base model, 308, has all three. In fact, there are six current models that take cartridges and a converter, and four of those models can be eyedroppered. I have this 308, a 323, a 480, and a 491. They all come with converters, but they're also pre-designed to be eyedroppered as well as they all have O-rings at the bottom of the section. Category 2, eyedropper. Then there are two models of Pen BBS that are eyedropper only. This is the 471 Mini Pocket Pen, and there is a double-ended pen, the 469. The 471 is a marvelous little pocket pen, or purse pen, that becomes a full-sized fountain pen when you screw the cap on to post and you fill the ink chamber here with an eyedropper and they're about the size of a large lipstick. I don't have a double-ended 469 but that pen has two ink chambers that are eyedropper filled. You can put two different size fountain pen nibs on it and use two different colors of ink 
or you can put a roller ball on one end if you wish because Pen BBS supplies it with a roller ball section included as an extra in addition to the two nibs and category 3 piston filler Pen BBS has one piston filler the 309 I admit this is not the best piston filler for the money and I'm hoping Pen BBS will redesign this model or come up with a new model piston filler soon category 4 the vacuum filler if the Pen BBS 309 piston filler is not exactly the crown jewel of the Pen BBS line I think the Pen BBS 456 vacuum filler is the best pen they currently make it's comfortable posts deeply and securely and becomes a well-balanced pen and it comes in so many incredible acrylics plus it's only 34 bucks for the base model I now have six of them galaxy black on black with a black nib very cool amber is a cat Tutsi, Niangao, and purple cloud thank you Linda category 5 the bulk filler so who else makes a bulk filler fountain pen anyone anyone just shout them out Bueller 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 well the answer is Conid and not Conid as well because they're not making them right now and there's no indication of when they might start making them again when they were making the Conid bulk filler they were priced far from affordability for most folks the pen BBS bulk filler is the 355 and it's yes 40 bucks I have one in amber as a cat and one in galaxy of course and for those of you that don't know the bulk filler acts like a syringe you pull the rod back to capture the piston that's back here you just keep turning the knob and then once it's captured the piston you push the piston down and then you put the nib in the ink and you pull the piston up and it sucks up ink into the barrel then you turn the rod back to the right again it disengages that rod from the piston and keeping the nib in the ink you push the rod back down again and close it up they take a ton of ink and it's a fabulous fountain pen so who else is doing this for 40 bucks huh Bueller 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 um he's sick category six the magnetic piston filler okay who's doing this but pen BBS I admit this filling system is a bit of a gimmick there are two models of magnetic fillers from pen BBS this one the 492 year of the rat and the 487 which is the production model of the same pen there's a magnet in the cap that pulls on the magnet holding the piston in the barrel and moves it up and down to suck up ink it's easier to see on this transparent model see the magnet sticks there you move the piston down to the bottom put the pen in the ink and then move the magnet back up again and it sucks up ink it's great in theory but it doesn't work so well in practice but again who is doing this but pen bbs and this 487 in galaxy yes was 40 bucks and category 7 the spring filler and the list of interesting filling systems continues this is the pen bbs 500 and it is a spring filler and as to who else is doing this well the twisby go has a spring filling system and this fan mu has a spring piston filler similar to the go but neither of them is as elegant as the pen bbs 500 and to those of you who think the 500 is a copy of the twisby go seriously i mean seriously I mean, come on. this is my 500 in amber i had a 500 in galaxy but i gave it to my son for his birthday and he uses it every day it takes a lot of ink and it's fun to fill you unscrew the end of the rod and it slides out and then you turn it in the opposite direction and it engages with that piston spring push the piston down put it in the ink and then let the spring up and it sucks up ink and you can do that as many times as you want to get a nice full fill once you've done that you retract the knob by turning it back the opposite way and screwing it down inside an ingenious little system and works very nicely 
this is the amber as a cap 500 and yes it was 39 dollars category eight the pump filler just when you thought we'd run out of filling mechanism types there is another one from pen bbs this is a pen bbs 348 pump filler this was a test model and i'm not sure what has become of the development of this into a full production model for pen bbs this came out about a year ago but it's intriguing the pen bbs design team took the body of their flagship model the 308 and incorporated an ingenious pump filling mechanism into it you take off the blind cap and then there is this mini spring filler inside a tube that when you pump it it pumps the ink up through that feeder tube that you see inside there just four or five little pumps like that and it fills that chamber it is very similar in concept to the parker vacuumatic that was patented back in 1932. there are a lot of pens that continue to use this kind of technology like this wingsung 601 flighter that uses a similar kind of pump filler mechanism but the fact that pen bbs with all their filling systems is exploring how to incorporate a vacuumatic into one of their models of fountain pens i find laudable they continue to find ways to explore new ideas and improvements to their products and what about finishes add to all the filling systems available a plethora of acrylic finishes that actually inspired the name of the pen bbs facebook fans page taste the rainbow and the range of choices is mind-boggling what seems to be your boggle my boggle just look at some of the variety of turned acrylic finishes that are made by pen bbs and you start to see why there are so many collectors of everything pen bbs now let's look at shapes there's a model for every taste it seems from the cigar and torpedo shapes of the 308 and the 480 to the flat top designs of the 500 the 355 and the 487 to the conical designs of the 309 and the 491 to the unusual shapes like the superbly shaped 323 and the desk pen rat tailed 267 and if you taste run to metal pens pen bbs has a couple of models in satin aluminum like this twisted 380 and brass like this new model 499 and the aluminum models come with an included rollerball uh, swappable nib and what about new models that's the other thing there are new models coming out all the time from pen bbs just recounting what i've seen since i've heard of pen bbs so that's about two and a half years now i've seen these new models the 480 torpedo shape the 355 improved model bulk filler the 491 the 500 spring filler the 487 magnetic filler a model 100 or with a 14 karat gold hooded nib the 348 test model pump filler and the 499 brass and then add to that the annual chinese new year pens this one from 2020 the year of the rat 492 magnetic piston filler and the 2021 year of the ox 535 which is a bulk filler we're still waiting on the year of the tiger 2022 pen model and you can add to that list calligraphy nibs not just one calligraphy nib but 22 of them i'll repeat that 22 of them 15 of those are in 14 karat gold with a variety of hand engraved designs from flowers to koi finish the steel calligraphy nibs like this one are 20 dollars and the 14 karat gold ones start at 114 plus the company continues to sell parts bags so users can maintain their own pens and replacement nibs in these wonderful nib charms for only six bucks and in buy these selections you can purchase bookmarks notebooks pen rests like these and craft knives like this one in a beautiful pen bbs acrylic called starry night pen bbs also sell ink in fact that's how they got started as a group before they made pens they don't sell the ink through the etsy shop for international shipping reasons but you can purchase pen bbs inks through van ness pens based in arkansas in the united states and they also ship to canada and there you have it if you like this video please like and subscribe 
And don't forget to ring that bell to get instant notifications whenever a new video is posted. You can also join as a member of my channel too for only 99 cents a month. I guarantee I'll answer your comments in the comment section and you'll get cool emojis and badges. Plus now I'm providing unboxing videos as I get new pens exclusively for members only. And that just leaves it for me to say, thank you for watching. And that's all she wrote. I made this.